so the marshmallow is the moon and our light source will be the top of the garage there that light so we have a full moon when i am directly in between the marshmallow or the moon and the the sun right and, and you are earth yeah i am earth now if i move it over this way part of the marshmallow we'll say it's a gibbous now because part of it is being shadowed and it still i am somewhat still in between the light source and the moon the sun and the moon now when we go to make me and the moon even with the sun it's a half a marshmallow now so as long as i am in between the moon and the sun it should be bigger than half a marshmallow or half a moon always whenever i am in between it now when i go and make the marshmallow closer the line will get even smaller and smaller as i get closer to the sun until it gets to halfway point again it'll start getting smaller the crescent will always get smaller when the moon is in between you and the sun and take note that you are now an in the day light you're now at daytime yeah now i'm at daytime yeah i'm looking at the sun so that's your new moon right there and then it starts crescenting and you can see it and that's all you should ever see when so the, the crescent moon. always happens yeah the crescent always happens during the daytime it's during should. the daytime and around the back 50, you can never see it at the, midnight what i need you to do now it. what i need you to do is do a waltz around the light while you are um yeah I need you to do a waltz around the light, if you know what I mean, because the Earth and the Moon spins at nearly the same rate. It takes 28 days for that Moon to get around the Earth, or you know what I mean. So that's the bit that I'm I'm trying to get my head around is that bit, because you are doing it in, you're doing a whole month in a in a turnaround there. Slow it down, but Zach, can you set up a gibbous Moon for us? Right there. Okay. Yeah. So Here, I'll get the, it even closer. See, you can yeah. still see the marshmallow where it's shadow. So you can see, look, Rob. The, the, that's daylight. That's daylight. And he's got one, hasn't he? No, no. That's the. That's the. No, I'm that's, facing away. That's so away from be, daylight. I'm in between. It, can you see where his head's facing? His head, i.e., the position of the earth where he is on the earth, means it's night yep. time. Yep. So he can yep. see. Right. Now keep the moon, the marshmallow, where it is. And what Zach's going to do is turn his head around like he's possessed so it becomes daytime for him. How can he see that gibbous moon in the daytime visual horizon he has? Bring it, bring it, bring... Bring the marshmallow back round to you now, Zach, and look what happens to the marshmallow. It turns into a crescent. Now, if if he turns his head to midnight and leaves it in the crescent, how can he ever see that crescent at night? Yeah, all right. Right. We What's did all those freaking yeah, slides, right. and we only needed a marshmallow. <laughs> That's class, Zach.